great. We're live. Yay. Hi, everybody. Hello. Hello, and welcome, everyone, to our regular First Look book review show, which today has no book review. <laughs> <laughs> but instead, I have two lovely guests. Some of you may already know them. Uh, we have, and when you are here, by the way, when you say hello, come on in and uh, just say hello. Let us know that you're here so we can give you a shout out. So yeah, uh, of course, I am Julie Broad. Um, and joined today with and this is mirrored, so it's a little weird. <laughs> Here we go. Uh, I'm joined with Jacqueline Kyle, who is in charge of our client care at Book Launchers, and Sarah Bean, who is in charge of book marketing at Book Launchers. So now is a great time for you guys to ask questions about book marketing, about um, some funny things that can happen when you upload your books. <laughs> something Jacqueline's been dealing with lately when she's been uploading some client books, um, which is really topical, actually, because KDP print uh, taking over or create space disappearing and KDP print being the one to replace it, uh, everyone's kind of got a learning curve as we all kind of figure out what works and what doesn't work and what's different. So there's been some interesting uh, learning experiences there. Uh, so yeah, so it's open Q&A, so you just go ahead and hey, Amber, welcome. <laughs> Thanks for saying hello. And so yeah, so by the way, today is our holiday extravaganza. We should have had Santa hats or something. I, should, I, didn't, <laughs> I didn't even think of that. So yeah, so it's our holiday extravaganza. So we've got lots of prizes. And uh, the only way to win prizes while watching is to say hello. Um, and we'll probably have some fun ways for you to win prizes as we go along too. All right, um, so to kick things off, let me just, uh, you guys can say a few things while I pull up my notes. Just uh, yeah. I can say things. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> um, let's see, this week at Book Launchers, I have been doing lots of loading of books, which is very exciting when you have taken your book from writing to having a physical book in your hands. And it is a lot of fun, and it's also very finicky. <laughs> yes, I think we discovered that KDP print covers have to be a slightly different size than the covers that you're uploading to Ingram. So yes. if you're like a lot of authors I know and uploading to multiple places, you're going to need to have different sizes for your book covers. <laughs> yes. uh, and I would just say that I'm really excited about 2019. I think there are going to be some amazing projects that are coming out in addition to the ones that we've already had come out in the last few months. So. Uh, can't wait to dive in with a lot of you authors and uh, take your books all the way to launch. Yeah, and speaking of launches, one of them is right over here. Let's see here. We should have had those over here too. I know, whoops. That's just, so I get my exercise today. Okay. <laughs> all right, so, and again, this is where the mirror is weird, so I, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Trying not to cover uh, Sarah's face. So yeah, huge, huge congratulations to Todd. And uh, Todd's book came out and is still sitting at number one in uh, the retirement category. Uh, early retirement? Retirement? Plan retirement retirement planning. planning. That's what it is. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and, uh, and yeah, so when he launched, he launched in that number one spot on the category, and he is still number one in that category. So that's pretty fantastic. Congratulations, Todd. Hey, Jeremy. Oh, thanks, Jeremy. That's so <laughs> nice of you. Welcome. So yeah, we were just saying that to win, you have to be here and you have to say hello. So you guys are already well on your way. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to start off by giving Todd a huge shout out because his launch was last week and uh, it's going strong. So yeah. that's pretty cool. And uh, Todd's book will be one of a few of the prizes that we'll be giving away today. Uh, we're just kind of you know, easing into it while people join us. But yeah, if you're just joining us, please do say hello. And uh, and yes, Jeremy, you want to win. You, you know, the odds are good right now that you can yeah. win. <laughs> <laughs> and for those of you watching on the replay, sorry, I keep, uh, the natural inclination is for me to move this way, which I know moves me off the screen. <laughs> um, so yeah, if you're watching the replay, there are going to be a couple of prizes for those of you who watch on YouTube uh, as a replay. But most of the prizes are for you folks who are here watching us live. Hi, hello, man. Lynette. Hello. Um, and so Amber says, my children's book publishes the 25th, and I learned about covers on KDP over the last couple of weeks. Yeah. It's definitely a learning experience. Yeah. It's hard. <laughs> yeah. Um, and hello, Lynette. Welcome. Uh, okay, so Todd, I wanted to say a huge uh, congrats to Todd, and then I want to give a shout out to some folks who have been such great commenters on the YouTube channel. So huge, huge shout out to April Braswell, Greg Jenkins, Brian Cressman, 
Miss Amber, Fee O'Shea. Thank you so much. You guys have been such regular commenters and you are in the prize for this week to win as well. So for those of you who are tuning in live and you don't know, or if you're watching the replay and you don't know, if you comment the day a video comes out, uh, which is Fridays right now on YouTube, so this is on bookclunchers.tv, uh, you will be entered to win a fabulous prize. And it's usually some pretty cool book launcher swag, um, and I have I had to order more mugs because they were so popular. <laughs> it's Vanna White, this. Ooh. <laughs> Lovely. It's so much better when someone else does it. And then instead of me, instead of me always going, okay, which sign is it? Okay. <laughs> so yes, so we have our usual prize, uh, but we also have other prizes today too. Um, so we'll, we'll actually be giving away something right away uh, for all of you early, early arrivers. Um, but just one sec, let me check my notes before I do that. Um, yeah, I think that's it. So the very first prize that we're going to give away is actually a course. Um, we're going to give one of the big, big prizes away right away because you guys were the first to join in. And I think you should be rewarded for Make being sure here early. Make sure you're say hello so we know. Exactly. So if you haven't already said hello, this is the only way you can win is to say hello. And, uh, and then we'll tell you how you're going to win. But first, we're going to tell you what you can win. So this course is courtesy of my friend Dale Roberts, who runs Dale Roberts Self-Publishing Channel, another fantastic YouTube channel out there. He has a do-it-yourself self-publishing course. So book launchers, we help you write, publish, and sell books. So um, I can't say we make it necessarily easy because book writing has its challenges no matter how you approach it. But we do a lot of the work for you. We're, we're your professional self-publishing team. Uh, and so this is really good for business professionals and entrepreneurs and people who are really busy in their careers and they want to use a book to grow their business. You give uh, you, your expertise comes out in the book however you want, whether you want a writer to write for you, write with you, or a writing coach to coach you. We'll help you through all those ways and then take it through the whole process uh, for you. Dale's course is perfect if you're somebody who's like, I'm going to do it all myself and I just need a little helping hand so I know what comes next. So it's a really comprehensive course to walk you through everything that needs to happen to take your book from idea to published. So great course, a couple points that he teaches in it how to efficiently research and choose the best niches to publish in. So if you're thinking, I want to be a professional author and you want to figure out how you're going to make money as an author, you want to choose good niches unless you've got a passion project you really want to write on. So he's going to walk you through how to do that. Um, he's going to talk about editing and formatting your manuscript, identifying the best possi possible solution for writing proficiency based on your time and your funds, which is very important criteria. Um, he's also going to talk about uh, book descriptions, um, promotions that don't cost a lot of money, producing book covers, and on and on. Thanks. Oh, hey, there's Dale. <laughs> Speak of the devil. Love, 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 love. We were just talking about your fantastic course, Dale. So, uh, so it's going to be one of the very first things that we give away right now. So now the question is, how do we choose a winner? What do you want to do? Um, random number generator? What? Yeah, we could do a random number. So somebody can just pick a number and we'll just see who commented and go with that. Do you want to do that? Okay. Okay, so you guys pick a number. You can't see I'm hiding the comments from them so they can't have any bias towards this. Uh, okay, there's 12 comments, so it's 1 through 12. 7. Okay, 7. So we're going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Amber! Amber! I'm all the jazz hands today. Sparkle, sparkle over here. Yay, Amber! All right, so Amber, and by the way, I, I'm pretty sure that this course sells for $2,000. I didn't mention that. Um, Dale's here, so he can confirm, and you can even post a link, Dale, to uh, the page. For those of you who aren't winning, you can go and check out the course, and, uh, and if you want to be a do-it-yourself self-publisher, then this is a fabulous resource to help you get started and, uh, and publish. So, um, Amber, congratulations. Send me that an email. Is, Amber's goal was. was to get the mug. We <laughs> 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 just upgraded a bit for you. Yeah. <laughs> it's going to be huge. Oh, well, you're Miss Amber. Oh, that's wonderful. That's great. <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> well, it's a small upgrade. <laughs> a $7 mug versus a $2,000 course. I mean, it's the holiday extravaganza. <laughs> Anything can happen. <laughs> She's like going to keep coming back to the mug, though. She's going to keep coming back to <laughs> That's great. So, so email us at team, T-E-A-M, at booklaunchers.com with your information, Amber, and we'll hook you up. And a huge, huge thank you to 
to Dale. And if you guys aren't already following Dale's YouTube channel, do check it out, uh, Self Publishing with Dale. He's really got the like cutting edge stuff and lately he's been on an unboxing like rampage so if you're curious what books look like when they come out of all of the different options to do print on demand um, you can see all of the different options literally over at Dale's channel because he's been an unboxing madman <laughs> <laughs> Oh, good one to check out. Yeah. yeah see even Amber said he did such a great self-publishing distributor comparison lately so yeah that's awesome all right, so here we go. <laughs> yeah, Dale says, "Hey, what's up?" Oh, I came at the right time. Yeah, we just we just dove in. We're like, okay, first on, first yeah. on the scene deserves to be rewarded. Mm -hmm. Start with so, a bang. Yeah, so we started with a big bang. Hey, Dave. Hi. <laughs> and Dave's asking, "Where's Tim?" Well. Uh, it's getting to be the end of the year and we have a ton of book projects that yeah. are working with the writing coach and all going, oh my goodness, I need to finish this book before the end of the year or make sure it's going to be launching early in 2019. So Tim said he couldn't join us today. So um, he's yeah. busy coaching many, many he's fantastic. He's in, in coaching right now. He's, yeah. he's doing a great job. We have so many fantastic books coming out, and I can't wait to tell you about all of the ones that uh, that we're working on behind the scenes right now. Um, but yeah, so Tim Tim was too busy, so he didn't join us. But I think he was going to tune in, so you may see him here in the comments somewhere. Um, and if you just tuned in, make sure you say hello. We have a ton of prizes, and if you have questions about book marketing, we've got our book marketing pro in the house. And if you have any questions about the entire self-publishing process between Jacqueline and myself, we can answer it. And if we can't, we can point to Dale, who could also answer <laughs> <laughs> we'll oh, Dale. Dale's comment there that his course is unavailable to the public. Oh my Ooh. goodness, I didn't even know that your course, so this course isn't even VIP. available. This is really VIP. I didn't even know that we were that exclusive. Thanks, Dale. That's very cool. <laughs> Thanks to Dale and congrats to Amber. That's fantastic. Um, and three more books are on the way for self-published unboxing. That's pretty incredible. <laughs> Dave, oh. I'm, I'm assuming you're saying that because Tim didn't join us, not because of something we said, right? <laughs> so yeah, if you're just tuning in, make sure you say hello because we're about to give away more prizes. And Dave, I'll ask you, how should we give away the next prize? Should it be a skill testing question or do you have some other fun way to select a winner? So I'll, I'll turn that over to you, Dave, while I uh, get out what the next prize is actually going to be. All right, we need a drum roll. Go. Good job. That probably sounded really Really loud. <laughs> yeah. Whole mic was going up. <laughs> to those of you watching with headphones on, we're sorry. <laughs> hey, Hi, Kelly. hey Kelly, good to see you here. <laughs> yeah, I know. Probably should. Okay. So there uh, so no wait, don't. That comes out of our pocket. Never mind. I don't know what he's talking about. <laughs> he said skill Dave said skill testing question. Okay, so now the sure. question is what is the skill testing question? I don't know. Oh, all I know is minutia. I don't know. You use the word minutia in a sentence. <laughs> all right. So the first person to use minutia in a sentence will, in a sentence that makes sense, by the way, um, will win whatever I'm holding down here. It's going to be a prize reveal. So you'll you'll find out what you win once we get the sentence. How about that? Ooh. I can see it. It's good. Yeah, it's a good one. It's a good one. Yeah. Um, okay, and while we're doing that, we got to think of how we're going to give away the next prize. And again, if you guys have questions, now is your time to ask. But otherwise, we'll just be, uh, you know, giving away prizes. I can prizes. pull up a randomizer. Yes, do that. I'll do it. Okay, good plan. Okay, so skill testing question. Um, oh, here's a question, a real question. <laughs> okay, that'll be our third. That'll be our third prize question, Dave. <laughs> nice. Um, and actually, that's interesting because I know the answer. Um, I don't think we're going to hazard a guess at all. But I, yeah. See, no. see the, we like our jobs. The answer is zero. Oh. But, oh, I just gave it away. Sorry. <laughs> okay, we'll have to come up with a new question. Okay, so Amber has a real question. Can anyone tell me I plan to publish on the 25th through KDP? Do I hit the publish button at 12 a.m. to make sure it's available for publication the day of publication? Or how does it work? So, um, I'm just going to field this one. Please do. When you hit publish, um, well, one, you, you need to make sure that it loads correctly um, prior to when you want to publish. It, there's nothing worse than being on a deadline and saying, okay, I'm going to upload my book right now and hit publish and I, I need to hit this deadline. And then you have a problem with your cover. Uh, it, it is a, a something that happens quite often. So you'll be able to pre-flight your book 
before you hit publish. So definitely upload it, get all that information in there. And then um, once you hit publish, it takes one day usually for an ebook to show up all across Amazon and it can take up to 72 hours before it hits all of the markets. Uh, print book wise, it is usually 72 hours before it is completely available everywhere. So if I was you, I'd be uploading the 22nd and telling everyone it's the 25th. Good answer. Um, okay, so uh, we were picking the next winner. So for those of you just joining us, make sure you're commenting because we're picking winners from the comments. Plus we have some skill testing questions for you uh, that we're making up. <laughs> might be missing one name. Okay, so she's just, she's I'm randomizing. Just, I'm randomizing and I'm just checking to make sure I got everybody. And if you're just joining us, comment now. Please we're about comment. To give away a prize. Yes. It'll be just in time. Oh, oh, there's a couple more down there. Yeah. Here we go. Okay. So and Marnie's here. Yay! Hi, Marnie. Oh, Marnie. Hi, Marnie. I'm looking forward to our call tomorrow. She just put Oh, good. Yeah. All right. So. Oh, and then one more. Oh, great. Oh, yeah. Okay, great. Okay, so this is for. I've got nine um, names here. Did I miss a prize? Oh, no. But the skill testing question came up, and then I gave away the answer, right? Right. Yeah. <laughs> so we're going to come up with a new question in the meantime. So, oh, oh, oh. Um, let's see. What would be a good question? This is a skill testing question? Yeah, something skill testing that wasn't about how many coffees I need to drink, because Kelly crushed that answer. <laughs> 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 Kelly totally knew the right answer. Um, let's go with, oh, what month? Is my birthday in? Okay, good. That's good. And Dave, you can't answer. Okay, <laughs> especially if you get it wrong. <laughs> and in the meantime, we have a new prize winner. This is randomly drawn from those of you commenting and saying hello. Um, and so, who is the winner? And then I'll tell them what they've won. Randomly. Winner is Amber. <laughs> what? <laughs> Amber? Miss Amber, it pays to show up early. All right, so you are <laughs> the proud, proud owner of Screaming for Pleasure, How Horror Makes You Happy and Healthy. This book is such a great read. And even if you're not into horror, you probably will love the book anyways. But even if you're not, I bet you there's somebody on your list this holiday season who would love this book. So I will get a copy shipped out to you right away um, once you email us with your mailing address for both of the prizes. And uh, I think we're going to say no more prizes for Amber. Yeah, sorry, Amber. <laughs> sorry, Amber. Sorry, Amber. <laughs> sorry, Amber. But I can attest that even, I mean, this book is really, it, it's phenomenal. And even if you're not a horror fan, which I can say that I'm not, I was so engrossed in, in the, the, the author amazing. just does so much research and makes it so personal. Um, I'm excited for you to check it out. It, it really like digs down into why things scare you. And mm -hmm. I, what scares you, Julie? What scares me? Yeah. Oh, the list is long. <laughs> 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 but snakes are pretty high on that list. Uh -huh. <laughs> zombies are on my list. I know that they don't exist, but I'm afraid of zombies. Ooh. And hunger. <laughs> I'm scared of hunger. <laughs> Okay, um, and I just have to point something out too because I just think this book was so beautifully laid out and yeah. laid out. So I just want to show you guys because you know we're all about books here. Um, just check out. Hopefully, you can kind of translate here. I'll show it a little closer. There we go. It's just like an example of the layout inside. Is it's I think. I think my team did a great job. <laughs> and, Scott, a and Scott made great choices too. So mm -hmm. yes. So congratulations, Amber. It is a great, great read. Um, okay, so uh, <laughs> Rochelle says January, not January. Um, uh, Amber wants us to pick another viewer. That's very sweet, Amber. Are you? Oh, uh, I can do that. Okay. Are you well, sure? Yeah. She's okay. We'll do that. You did win a two thousand dollar course. So <laughs> yeah. yeah. Hey, Lara Treville, welcome. Hello. I'm adding you to our randomizer right now. And Dave's being moderately inappropriate. So we'll just, uh... <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're still waiting for those of you who joined. Um, <laughs> we are waiting for somebody to guess the month of my birthday and you're getting the next prize. And do say hello when you join in because mm -hmm. we are, we're gonna randomize another name, I think, if yeah. you get, yeah, we're gonna yeah. randomize another name. We still have more prizes to give away. Um, and, uh, and the next prize we're gonna give away 
uh, is going to be a one hour call with our writing coach, uh, well, one of our writing coaches, but our main writing coach on our team, who is also an Emmy nominated writer. Um, fun fact about him is he had a, a software book, a computer software book, basically, and uh, he came up with an idea for a TV series, pitched it, and ended up writing and starring in a TV series for seven years, which is what he got nominated for an Emmy for. So you get a one hour call with him, which is not available for sale outside of our clients who get to work with him when they're writing their books. So that is going to be the one after so the randomized one that Sarah's doing mm -hmm. but first we're still looking for my birth month who got it <laughs> um, okay uh, May I love that word we're just trying all the month <laughs> and yet you still skip some of them so anyways May June July October <laughs> Oh, that's some crazy ones. Uh, that's the prize I want. <laughs> January, you want the you want the writing coach call is what you're trying to go for. So that's good. You're in the random draw, Jeremy. You're yeah, still up you for it. Um, February, there you go. You got Yay. it. <laughs> However, that wasn't the writing coach uh, prize. I'm afraid the prize that you got was the Leverage Equation, Yay. which is another fantastic book, by the way. Um, I my real my background's in real estate, so I've read a ton of financial planning type books. And I kind of was like, oh, leverage, whatever, it's like buy real estate, that's leverage. And this book barely talked about real estate. Real estate's only a tiny, tiny thing. And in fact, it's not even really the, the leverage is so much more. Um, and I was fascinated by this. I think every business owner, savvy financial planner should read this because he talks about, you know, making more of your time, making more of your money, making more of your knowledge. And uh, yeah, very, very cool, useful book. Um, so Jeremy, you're still in the draw for the writing coach on the randomizer, uh, but email us at team at booklaunchers.com and we'll send you this book. And if it's not for you, then I bet you there's somebody on your list who will uh, be a great candidate for this book because it is really, really, really great. Uh, really excited about it. Uh, what I find really fascinating about this book is every time you read it, you get something new out of it because sure. it is something that you build upon. And so you may come in with one piece and you learn how to tweak it and make it a little bit better. And then the next time you read it, you go, oh, now I'm on to this piece and I can learn how to you know, really maximize it. So it it's, gives some really great advice. And I think it appeals to different phases in your life too. Yeah. So it'll certain parts will speak to you more than others. Right. Um, and then point. you'll read it again later and, and you'll get much, much more out of it. So, yeah. yeah it's, it's a good one. Great. I love it. All right. So um, let me just see if there's any other prize or comments. Hey, April, welcome. Hello. Hi, April. Uh, adding you to our randomizer. Okay. And Treville, did you get Treville in there? I got Treville. Okay. And I got uh, Laura. Got um, you? Yeah, great. Awesome. Okay. Are we redoing? Um, Amber wanted to. Oh, yeah. someone else oh yeah we'll, somebody yeah. else could win so we'll well we'll do the writing coach and then we'll go back to um the book the okay. so we're going to do okay. the writing coach call next and we're using the randomizer for this so if you haven't already said hello then it's too late for the writing coach um, call <laughs> managed to get into your live i'll be at late all right April, okay you're, oh yeah I got yeah you. you're in the draw okay, okay so right, ready? Go. Do, do, do. i won't pound the table this time in case that was disturbing for you guys all right oh, all right, technical <laughs> errors. Sorry, I need a little bleep. So yeah, so to reveal how you get involved, we have skill testing questions, so you're just gonna have to take a guess when we have those come up. And we also, if you're just commenting and joining in the fun, that also gets you entered to win. Um, and then if you have other questions, we're doing open Q&A. It's a great time to ask us questions. Uh, we already had one really great question that Jacqueline handled masterfully. Uh, so if you guys have other questions, we can try to showcase our knowledge. Otherwise, we'll just keep giving stuff away. We've got at least another 10 minutes worth of giveaways. <laughs> yeah, we do. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I had to, like, reload the whole thing. But I'm getting everybody in there. And got it. And... Yes, and, and, April, and April says reading really does help us build our biz, biz, businesses, and that's right. Jeremy, April. hey, Jer oh, yeah, hey, how about that? And yeah, <laughs> this is a, this is a randomizer. So it is a randomizer. That's hilarious. So this, <laughs> yeah. Was, yeah, that's so funny. So Jeremy, congratulations, you wanted yeah. that writing coach call, so you got it. So now you can win. You've won. What's with us winning two people in a row here? I All don't right. know. So I'm now, a different randomizer. So Jeremy and Amber. You've won your prizes for the yeah, day. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so skill testing question. We did birthday. Uh, ooh, uh, name. Okay, I, I, this will be the last question about me. It's just because when I'm thinking of it, I'm like, so name one city other than Los Angeles that I have lived in. Again, Dave can't 
qualify for this. So yeah. there you go. Name one city that I've lived in other than Los Angeles, and then you will be the prize is that screaming for pleasure. We're re, we're re gifting Amber's prize because uh, she was kind enough to say I already won a fantastic course. So take it away, someone else. All right. So that's the skill testing question. Um, you go ahead and type that in. You have to come up with the next skill testing question. So you think about that while we're waiting for the answers and getting more comments here. Okay. All right, cool. Um, here we go. Writing coach, writing coach, writing coach. It's gone, but we have, you know what's really cool, April? You'll like this one. We have a one hour call with Sarah, who is our book marketing pro. She has worked on lots of book projects. She's worked booking speakers into mm -hmm. speaking gigs. So she's got tons of expertise around book marketing. And I know you've got books coming out, April. So yeah. that will be a great one for you. Mm -hmm. So that is coming up. All right, uh, congrats on being shouted to Jeremy. Um, toss the randomizer, Dave. Yeah, it's not a good one. I, I had to look for a new one. I mean, not. I'm glad Amber and Jeremy won, but we're gonna we're gonna mix it up here. Yeah. Um, and so I'm just waiting for prizes. Uh, congratulations, Jeremy. Orlando, good guess. Good guess, oh, Kelly. Dave. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> I'll pick a winner. <laughs> All right, now you're making me blush. Okay, um, Orlando, no, but good guess. Oh, Marnie, wow, Yay. nailed it, Congrats. yes, nailed it. Minimo, that's correct. So, uh, and that was, was that for the call with, with Sarah, which you already get? So. <laughs> I, I thought that was, did I lose, oh no, that's for Scott's book, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah that was the re -gift. okay, good. I was like, well, that's kind of, we'll have to give you something else, but. Perfect. So, Marnie, you are now the proud owner of this book. And uh, we already gave it a good spiel earlier. Yeah. Um, so I won't go into it again, but it is a great gift or a great read or both. Um, so there you go. Congratulations and thank you. Hey, that's great. I'm so thrilled. You nailed it. <laughs> uh, okay. So for the writing, or sorry, for, for the book marketing, we're going to have to do something Special. What should we do? That should be another randomizer. Do you have a better randomizer? I do. I picked one. Yeah, okay. I got a better one. So we're gonna do the the um, call with Sarah. Will be another randomized thing. So if you haven't already said hello, make sure you've got your name in the list, and uh, and she'll get you entered there. And we also will have another skill testing question because we have that one. We have two more books to give away. Um, uh, so you want to give them the skill testing question while she's randomizing? Sure. I, I was curious. We have a ton of comments. I know. Well, yeah. so the people guessing where I lived. And actually, oh. some of you people are, in fact, right as well. So Nanaimo was uh, absolutely, it's kind of where I call home. Uh, when I go home, I go home to Nanaimo. So Marnie nailed it. Um, Seattle is a good guess. I've uh, never lived anywhere in the States except for Los Angeles, though. Uh, so all answers in Canada would, would have been pretty safe. Yeah. Vancouver Kelly is correct. I've also lived in Vancouver. Um, New York, nope. <laughs> um, New York City, no. I know, I seem really big city, don't I? <laughs> <laughs> Um, Montreal, nope. <laughs> Las Vegas, no, but I love Las Vegas. <laughs> Vegas is becoming Julie's second home. <laughs> Dave, Dave attests to my love of Vegas. It's mostly my love, love of poker, uh, but uh, yes, I, I have this thing for Vegas uh, because there's a poker table everywhere. Um, so yeah. <laughs> uh, Marnie, fun, okay. Uh, Denver, nope. So yeah, it's, it's Canada, Canada. You could have guessed. Calgary, Toronto, Edmonton, Victoria, Vancouver, uh, and Nanaimo. I think that's it. I think that's all of the cities I've lived in. Um, also, a small town called Bassano, which I would have fallen off my chair if someone guessed that. <laughs> if you did, you were stalking my Facebook profile. Yeah. Okay. April, um, if you're having trouble, um, try reloading the page. Sometimes that solves the issue. Yeah, yeah. So April said she's having a, a sound leg. I don't know if any nobody else has said anything, so that might reloading might help you, April. Um, Dale says nice cover. Yeah, was that the screaming for pleasure one? Um, yeah, I love yeah. that cover. Okay, trivial poker skills, 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 poker skills, skills, skills. skills. Okay, so okay. I think we're cut. So I'm ready to randomize. All right, hit. All right hitting the button and Kelly. Kelly Roberts? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> she could. You guys can exchange. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so Kelly, congratulations. Nice. That actually it would be a really interesting call for the two of you um, to exchange. Uh, Kelly does a lot of no content books. Oh, um, so so yeah, it'll be a fun. All right, so we're gonna have a back and forth and see what we can pick up from each other. Yeah, I'm excited about that. That's awesome. So congratulations and Yay. thank you for being here. Um, all right, so Jacqueline has a question for another yeah. one of the two books that we have left to yeah. give away today. So I have an industry question. Ooh. So. 
Um, in America, the big ebook distributor is Kindle on Amazon. And in Canada, the big one is Kobo. And they have recently made a play and a deal with a major retailer Ooh. in America to break into the American market. Do you know which retailer it is? If you've been reading the launch letter, then you should know this because I talked <laughs> about this very recently. So that's a good one. Um, and if you're not getting the launch letter, you should be going to booklaunchers.com when we're done and, and signing up there so that you get, uh, it only comes out every two weeks and there's lots of great tips and keeps you up to date on important things like that. All right, so let's see. Uh, yeah, I did kind of live in Las Vegas with uh, <laughs> it was a, yeah, I miss it. It was a quarterly visit to Vegas. Um, all right. Oh, Trivial, you pay poker too? Oh, we'll have to get together. Uh, just just don't beat me because then it makes me sad. Okay. Don't take my money. Uh, okay. Lag here too. Oh, you got a lag too. Well, it, mm. it could be our internet here, uh, but eh. Dave, are you having any lags? Is it working okay for you? Um, holy cuss words, people? <laughs> What? I don't. Oh, I think she's cussing over there. Not no. not writing cuss words. Um, okay, uh, Amazon, KDP. Can I win twice? Yeah, Kelly, Kelly, and Dale are gonna know these answers. <laughs> yeah. um, you can win twice, Kelly, but I, I appreciate you holding back and giving someone else to try. But if nobody gets it soon, then yes. And this the next prize. Um, the next prize that we're giving away, you might enjoy, or again, it might be a good uh, a good fit for someone on your list. So you never know. Books make amazing stocking they stuffers. They do. They yeah. do. Um, all right, Barnes and Noble. I don't know. Nope. Nope. Not Lulu. Oh, yeah. somebody cheated. Well, I guess it's not cheating. It's being resourceful. We'll yeah. call, we'll call uh, you. But Amber, um, you already know. You're, you're you're not on the list. Yeah. So I'm sorry, Amber. We'll just. Oh, there we. And Kelly did get it. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so we're waiting for someone else to just copy the correct answer that has already been said. <laughs> yes. In the meantime, I'm trying to think. Oh, I have to give, we have our, our Friday commenter. So, um, and again, I'm actually going to just, because I had a printing issue today. So I don't know if this is going to mess you guys up, but these are my names. And I'm going to, can I send this to you, Sarah, and you can mm -hmm. randomize it? Yep. That's what I'll do. Okay. Yeah, yeah, send so... How do I? I think it's the arrow on the top right. Yeah. So don't mind us as we're just staring. It looks like we're staring blankly at you guys right yes. now. Um, but I'm actually uh, sending. Sorry, I don't know why I'm doing mime. I just figured I'd give you something to look at. <laughs> okay. <laughs> sorry, guys. There we go. Okay. So. Perfect. Yeah, just send that to me. If it would send. Why is it not sending? It doesn't have the send option. Hmm, that has never happened before. Um, how about just a random number generator and we can... Yeah, we might have to do that. Okay, so can you give me a random number and we'll just pick from that? Oops, I lost you guys. Let me close that. Out of how many? Uh, oh, I don't know. That may mean we have to count. One, two, uh, it looks three, like about 15. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 16. Uh, 16. All right, here we go. This is for the YouTube book launchers mug for the Friday commenters. So we're going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Mandy Lynn. So Mandy Yay. Lynn, congratulations. Yeah. Yay. That is for this. So email us at team at booklaunchers.com with your mailing address. And as long as you are in North America, I will ship one of these lovely mugs to you. And uh, yeah, and if you want to win one of those mugs, all you have to do is tune in on Fridays when videos come out. And by the way, in 2019, big news, I'm going to be releasing two videos per week, Tuesdays and Fridays. So you're going to have twice the chance to win book launchers mugs and I'm working on developing some new cool swag stuff I haven't given away before so you'll be entered to win that stuff too so um, plus I do give my regular commenters a shout out in the videos because we appreciate you guys so much <laughs> all right now our next prize let's see uh, if we found a winner <laughs> Google is how I kill my characters what do you I'm curious about this Amber so um, do you type in, uh, you know, how to kill someone into Google? <laughs> because that could probably put you on some flag lists. <laughs> That's how to hide the body. <laughs> how to hide a body. Yeah, Dave actually has a, did a little short film on how to hide a 
how to hide, how to hide a dead body. Thank you. Sorry, I'm, reading the, I'm reading the comments. Thank you, Dave. <laughs> Sarah did some epic miming now. I thought I was transported to class. Um, okay, there we go. Rochelle, Walmart. Yay! Yay! Thank you. Congratulations, Rochelle. Same thing. Email us at team at booklaunchers.com. And we haven't been writing down who's been winning what. I we'll have to watch the video. We'll have to watch them. They'll, they'll be proof, so you can't fool me. But do, do send me an email and tell me what you want. <laughs> it would make my job easier. Um, so that was for... I'm I, I can remember um, what you just did. This I thought that was that. Yes. yes. So We have not talked about that. We have not talked about what you just won. Elephant you won gym. The Elephant in the Gym, which is another fantastic book. Um, and this one, is, the subtitle is Your Body Positive Guide to Writing Your Own Health and Fitness Story. And really, it's an explanation, no, not quite. There's a, an explanation of kind of why the fitness industry doesn't want you to actually lose weight and get fit. Because <laughs> then they wouldn't have clients, right? So this is really a different approach than just another fad diet and just another, uh, you know, another different way of, of exercising. It's not like a new workout regime. It's not a new diet. It's really an entirely new approach approach to getting healthy, feeling great. Um, yeah, so I actually, um, this book got me back into the gym and I hired a personal trainer and he tried to get me to step on the scale and do all the things. And I was like, you know what? Elephant in the gym tells me that I just need to go with how I feel and what I want to feel like. And I want to be able to run 10 miles and feel good at the end of it again. So that's the goal, not a pound um, mm -hmm. result. So, and, and he had a hard time wrapping his brain around that one. Yeah. It was pretty yeah. hilarious. Yeah. So and, sounds, sounds like he needs to get a copy of this book. <laughs> I know. I kind of want to bring it in and be like, <laughs> yeah, for everybody. And another one, I just, it's just another beautifully designed book. So I just have to yeah. show you guys again, because I just think my team's done such a great job of these books. So, mm -hmm. so yeah, just another And example. another great thing about this book um, mm -hmm. for Rochelle to be aware of, and anyone who wants to pick it up, is that we've been working with Jillian. She is doing a ton of extra stuff that you get if you read the book. She's doing Facebook groups with exclusive coaching. She's doing yes. um, a course. She's doing things that are coming up soon. <laughs> Sorry, guys. She's doing, um, she's had some uh, great media coverage on the book. Uh, she's been featuring Weight Watchers Canada um, and all sorts of uh, really interesting things. She's incredibly interactive with her audience, which is a huge marketing. Yes, please interact with your audience as much as possible. So um, if you pick up the book, you're going to get to interact with Jillian in all sorts of amazing ways. So I can't recommend it enough. Awesome. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, I'm just, uh, hey, Dale, I just spammed you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> April, April, you're making new friends, Dale. So awesome. And yes, do connect with Dale Roberts if you guys haven't already. Uh, been such such a great supporter. Always so much good information too. So if something new is happening and I'm like, I got to get up to speed on this, I go to Tails channel. <laughs> so now you know my insider secret. <laughs> uh, Marty asked if we were going to be doing any of your books. Uh, yeah, I saw that. I skimmed past it. Oh, okay. <laughs> but we could. Yes, Marnie, Marnie asked if we were going to give away some of my books um, and we could. So it, the, in the, the future. We could do it today. I just didn't plan on it. I don't know why. I was too busy. I'm just so proud and focused on my clients' books that I kind of forgot about mine, honestly. I do have one more book to give away. Not a client's book, um, but it was a book I reviewed here on the channel. And uh, and I loved it, and I just thought it would be great for all of you folks wanting to write a book. Um, it's called Don't Write a Crappy Book, and it's by James Ranson. And uh, he graciously agreed to give away a copy to someone. Um, so if you're in the States, he'll ship you a physical copy. If you are anywhere else, he'll ship you, uh, ship you by that, I mean email you a PDF or e-version of the book um, for your reading pleasure. So that is our next prize. And uh, Sarah, what is the skill testing question? To now, let's do no. I gotta, you gotta use your brain this time. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, 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 no. me warning. <laughs> <laughs> well, we have com we have a lot of comments to All catch right. up on. So, hmm. um, April does write really long quality comments on my videos to raise my my vi my video engagement and <laughs> please the YouTube. She does. So, if you guys want to see how to be an amazing YouTube supporter, check out what April does on my channel. She writes really, really great comments and, and adds value to everybody checking out the comments too. So thank you so much, April. You'll definitely end up winning a mug. I know there's a mug in your future yes. at, the, at the bare minimum. <laughs> and the mugs are like the perfect Carrick, like full Carrick size and just like one creamer and it's perfectly filled. It's wonderful. 
that's funny. Um, and Amber says, my Google history would have me on a lot of lists. <laughs> <laughs> She says she's relying on a friend in the FBI to uh, keep her doorbell quiet. I don't know if that's a strategy or not, but good luck. <laughs> if, if suddenly Miss Amber stops commenting on my YouTube videos, I will, you know, call someone and say, hey, did she get picked up? <laughs> it was for her books. It wasn't real. <laughs> and Dave says we're having too much fun. He doesn't think we're actually at work, but you missed the three and a half hours of meetings we had prior to this. <laughs> Um, all right. Oh, okay, I've got a question. Okay, she's got a question. This is okay. for the James Ransom This book. is for the book, and if you have watched any of the other um, book launches videos that I've done in the past, I did a couple of, um, of videos. I did one video last month. I did a Zoom call that's been uploaded. I've talked to some of you on the phone about what my history is. So to win the book, where did I – one of the two jobs that I started my career in publishing – it might be kind of tough, like uh, what you did, or do they have to know the exact name of the company? No, they don't have to know the name of the company, just general job title. Okay. Uh, I've talked about this a number of times. Julie's talked about it in her newsletters. Yeah. Uh, so if you have ever watched a video or had a phone call with me or watched the uh, videos before, you may have caught this. Yeah, good one. And April, actually, her book actually does go deeply into some of that stuff. Um, so April was just commenting oh, okay. about, um, you know, a, an old diet and some of the things and yeah so there's there's actually her books really comprehensive it's hard to summarize it um, I kind of gave the marketing spiel but it's it's really actually touches on the emotional side of the things that you need to address to feel better and it's not just about I feel okay <laughs> it is definitely deeper than that for sure um, Hey, open James Ranson's book to page 178, and it's Dale. So yes, Dale <laughs> Dale is featured in James' book. I don't know why I didn't get featured. Maybe because he didn't, I didn't know him yet. That's probably it. He didn't exclude me on purpose, I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, excellent book. Um, and uh, Dave was saying mime again. Were you miming again? I was, no, I didn't do miming again. I can do it again if you like, oh, I wasn't before. Are you trying to be like Jackson and go, mime, do it, do it. <laughs> So Marty gets it. I, I would say that's right, don't you think? It's close enough. Yeah, it's yeah, close, it's close enough. enough. All right, so Marty, you are now the proud winner of James Ransom's Don't Write a Crappy Book. So just email me at team at bookauthors.com, please, just so I know and I remember, because the chances of me going back over this video to remember who everybody won. I, I got most of them. There's one I'm okay. missing, but I got most of the prizes Good. right here. Awesome. Okay, cool. Um, Congrats, Marty. Yeah. Yay. 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 <laughs> Nobody would purposely exclude you, Julie. Thank you. Okay, so we have one more prize, I believe. Just checking through my brain here. We've done the mug. We did the Dale Roberts course. We did three of our most recent launches. We did writing coach. We did a, yes. an hour call with me. We did the second book. Um, don't write a crappy book. That's right. Is there anything else? We do. We have one more of Dale's course. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, ding, and ding, ding. so we're going to actually, I have, I have several more of Dale's course. So this one I'm going to do, I'm going to do one more live and then I'm going for those of you watching the replay, cause I don't want to leave the replay out. Cause I know some of you just couldn't make it. Um, you have mean bosses who don't understand the importance of watching us give away prizes for an hour. <laughs> and, um, so if you're watching the replay and you've stuck, to this point, put a comment in that says, I stuck with you. Okay, that's all you have to do. Wow. I right. stuck with you. And I will, what's the date today? Today is the 11th. So on December 20th, because that's the, the work day I'm doing next week, <laughs> uh, December 20th, I will draw your name. I'll go live um, on Facebook probably and just draw your name from anybody who says, I stuck with it. And you'll be entered to win. Here's what I'm going to do. You're going to be entered to win Dale's course and both of my books. There you go. So that's what I'll get. There'll be two prizes. It'll be both of my books and Dale's course. And that's for the replay. Now we have Dale's one more of Dale's fantastic do-it-yourself self-publishing course. If you weren't here earlier, I gave a pretty good rundown on some of the key points that are in this course. It is not available for sale right now. It is exclusively for you fabulous people. Um, and all you need to do right now to win is, are we going to do randomizer for it? What should we do? We can do randomizer. Let's do got it ready. Okay, we've got randomizer. Right. Let's just see. Hold on. Let's see if there's any last entrance. Right. Let's make sure. Yes, okay. team, book launchers. Uh, that's correct. Yes. yes. 
Me course, yes, yes. Oh, oh Talita. Talita. Hey, you made Hi, it. Talita. Hi, okay. Talita. Um, I stuck with you. <laughs> <laughs> now, what you have to do is go put that on YouTube, and then you could be entered to win uh, the yes. prizes. <laughs> All, right. All right, are you ready? Yes. All right. I'm running this, and my phone doesn't want to work. Lynette! Yay! Yay! Lynette! And so, yes, thank you so much, Dale, for a fantastic prize. And when it is available live for the public, please let us know. Give mm -hmm. us a link so that we can share it with everybody who did not win this exclusive course to help them with all of the steps along the way. Um, and thank you to everybody for tuning in today. It was really great to have you Yay. all here and have you participate. It says we have 174 comments today. So that's, that's amazing. Good day. That's pretty. <laughs> I love these days. <laughs> that's pretty extraordinary. <laughs> <laughs> so thank you so much. And uh, thank you to Jacqueline and Sarah for joining us today as well. Um, and again, if you're watching the replay. Again. Yes. Just for Dave. <laughs> Are you climbing the tree? <laughs> I don't know how to mime. I'm just trying to keep some movement on there. Oh my goodness. I didn't know the skills that these folks have. I do not know. So, so talented. It yeah. is. You never know. I really have an extraordinary team. And then they're just two of the many people on the team. But <laughs> I'm learning new things every single day. So yeah, thank you so much for being here. And if you're watching the replay, do give it a thumbs up. And, uh, and do right. I stuck with you because you can win prizes. And again, 2019, new videos every Tuesday, every Friday. And, uh, and then we'll enter you to win. If you comment on the date a video is released, we'll enter you to win a, a mug or some other cool swag that we will have out in 2019. So thank you, everybody. Have a safe and fun holiday season. And uh, we'll be back live with you again in 2019. Bye. Bye, Bye everybody.